We are broadcasting live from Don't Ever Bank Here Field in Cracksome Skull, Florida, where elections can't be broken because <laughs> they're always fixed. The fans are ready for some mutant football. Well, I'm going to make like a presidential election ballot and disappear because I got to pee. Now, this is going to be a bloody game. The teams are loading their weapons and sharpening their spikes. The San Francisco 49 Nightmares battle, the Crocs and Skull Jugulars. Welcome to NFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. <laughs> Grim Blitzrow with you along with my partner, former player Brickhead Mulligan. Hi. And his life partner, the mini mutant head that lives on the shoulder of Bricks Jr. Hey, you just threw up on my shoulder. I don't often drink beer, but when I do, I get totally shit-faced. I am the world's most intoxicated man. Say that again. And it's first and ten. <laughs> up a two. And that'll be second and eight to go. He could go all the way. And it's first and ten. Tired of the quarterback tight spirals and magnetic Personnel. It's not how many times you fall, it's how you get back up. Yeah, in this particular case, I'm thinking defibrillators and 100 cc's of adrenaline. And it's first and ten. for one yard. Second down and nine. And he's on. Bam! Say goodnight to that guy, Bricks. Uh, Good night to that guy, Bricks. You're an idiot. First down and nine. He was stuffed at the line of scrimmage. So was that cheerleader. Second down and nine. The defender says, I don't think so. Third down and nine. With a brutal hit. And it's first and ten. He's leaving a wake of destruction in his path. His cleats are caked in blood and guts, and he's looking to score. He's at the 40. He refuses. Oh, the unstoppable force meets the explodable object. Boom, dead and down. He just sent a message with that hit. Yeah, the message was you can't kill the messenger, because he's going to kill you. But then he won't be able to read the message, because the messenger killed him. Ah, uh, going in circles.
First down and less than a yard. Defense says enough of this BS and jumps off sides to lay waste to the referee. Way to go, guys. And it's first and ten. He runs it for three. Second down and seven. Ooh, that hit's going to shave a few days off his life. Third down and, well, good luck. He picks up nine yards on that catch. You know, sometimes the best thing to do is just punt and let your defense get the ball back. Nice punt. Should move him back now. He's got the ball now and is going to try and score. One time when I was playing, a guy hit me so hard, I went into a dark tunnel. Thought I saw my grandparents waving at me in the light. Turns out it was just the visitor's tunnel that he knocked me into, and it was the paramedics waving fingers in my face. And it's first and ten. How do you like your defensive cook? The ball player is saying, well, the ball dead and down. He delivered the freaky fast ham sandwich with extra mustard for the death blow. Speaking of ham sandwiches, I'm going to go grab one. You want anything? Now, yeah, still working on my salami here, Bricks. Thanks. That's what she said. Ah, ah, good work that time. It was close, though. Yep. I am a hell of a son of a. And it's first and ten. That's a four-yard gain. Second down and six. And he runs it in for the touchdown. I never looked that good dancing, and I have skin. Don't want to make any mistakes here. Just kick the ball through the upright, for God's sake. It's good. They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing. <laughs> and it's first and ten. And that's the way to get the sticks moving. He picks up five on that play. Second down and five. Oh, and that quarterback threads the needle for a first down. And it's first and ten. I don't know whose eyes the QB is using, but can we get him? Now the offense is getting kills. This is really a violent game, guys. Another bullshit penalty. How long are these guys going to take this? Yeah. 
First down and inches. It's a jailbreak, and the defense jumps offside to kill the ref. Ho oh, ho! Crowd's loving it. <laughs> and it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot. hot oh, and that's how you play defense. Well, of course, he, he could have had an interception, returned it for a touchdown, and changed the entire game, but I don't want to nitpick. I do. The guy should have fucking caught it. Hot one, hot two, hot three. And the ball razors through the defense, cutting a defender in half. And then Katz will give them a first down. I don't know if they're his, but he sure has a good set of hands. First and four. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. 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 And into the end zone with a burst of speed. I think he's more of a downer's guy than a speed feet, Grim. He's running from his team, as it's clear. Hey, you see that move, baby? No, you didn't. You know why? I'm too fast for you. I'm the greatest. The greatest, I tell you. <laughs> Okay, nice and easy like a two-foot putt. You miss two-foot putts all the time, Grim. Right. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. The home team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five. <laughs> no doubt about it, that guy is dead. He says, I'm taking you with me. The burn returner was maimed by the opposing team, so it's up to the next man to replace him. Now, what exactly is a burn returner, Grim? Now, players who catch kickoffs and punts and run them back through the teeth of the defense. They have the lowest survivability rate of any player in the league. The next man up just sat back down on the bench. He probably grabbed his pants. And it's first and ten. laid the wood on that guy. Yeah, if you're gonna hit a guy that hard, you should at least kill him. Do him a favor. Finish him. Second down and nine. And so at the end of one, we're all tied up. We'll be right back. Second down and nine. Points on the heels of an epic run. Uh, don't call things epic, Grim. Kids aren't gonna think you're cool no matter what you do. Junior, I don't want kids to think I'm cool. I will. I'll ruin your world. Ruin it. You know, this should be easy, but with kickers, you never know. Straight through the uprights. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. And it's first and ten. That's the way to keep the chains moving. That was beautiful. It's first and ten. And the QB might have, he's leaving a wake of destruction in his path, and the body toll continues to climb. And it's first and ten. Now watch him stop all over his opponents. I want to 
take a big boost injection too. And Helena Weird he's rumbling and stumbling. He could go all the way. And the MFL keeps pounding out the death hits on WMFL 98.8. The greatest hits of all time. Uh, did you just say greatest hits? Wow. And it's first and ten. And he picks up maybe four on that play. Second down and six. And the quarterback throws another pick. He should have eaten his sleep. Oh, that's a vicious hit. And the crowd loves it. He just turned that guy into 300 pounds of ground mutant, man. Nope. And you can't hit a guy much harder than that. And that is unfortunate. And it's first and ten. Second down in a very lot. Oh, man, the offense called a murder ball. That's a little on the nose, don't you think? That's sort of this whole sport. I mean, the dirty trick, Bricks. The ball's going to kill the defense. But you may still have a point, actually. Third down and long. And that's another turnover for the defense. Oh, great tackle. When his brain is unscrambled, he'll be thinking about that hit. Yeah, most likely in a convalescent home. And it's first and ten. And he runs it for four yards. Second down and six. And there's another pick. Man, this quarterback must have learned a... You ever get hit in the head with a boat all grim? Nope. Well, I have on several occasions. Not surprising. Multiple times on each occasion. Not surprising. And trust me, that hit was worse. Fast. <laughs> And it's first and ten. And the defense goes for the juggler. If this guy can talk before he died, what do you think he'd be saying, Bricks? Psycho killer! Just to say, what the fuck, 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 fuck! And it's first and ten. guy's a brick shit house. That's a six yard gain. And that'll be second down and four. He caught it, and nothing was going to stop him from getting into the end zone. Except maybe self doubt, but he seems to have worked through it. And they line up for the extra point. It's good. When you get knocked down, you got to get right back up and fight. Uh, what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. Oh, with the brutal hit.
And it's first and ten. He is fighting for every yard and picks up maybe a deuce at most. Uh, speaking of deuces, I got a... Uh... <clears throat> Excuses for this QB. You just, you just throw it to the guy in the same color. Now the offense is getting kills. This is really a violent game, guys. Oh no, that was totally unnecessary. <laughs> I gotta see that one again. It was also freaking awesome. I hope they have raincoats in the front row because that was splattering everywhere. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot eight. And he'll pick up seven yards on that play. <laughs> Second and three. Two minutes remain in the half. Wait, I gotta take a dump. Second and three. Hot, hot one. Hot two, hot three. Man, oh man, he hit that line the way your wife hits the all-you-can-eat buffet of crab apple trees, Bricks. Ah, uh, you tell And they stop the clock with their first time out to try and stay in this game. Oh, nice coaching move there. Hall of Fame caliber. Well, I mean, it's a pretty standard coaching move at this point of the game. I won't listen to this blast for me. And the quarterback finds his man for the first down. Well, that's two timeouts burned, and you have to wonder, Bricks, are they desperate or are they in control? Yeah, I'm speaking from experience, Grim, but it really is hard to do both at the same time. And I have mastered it. And that's it. That's the last timeout. It's score or die from here out. Second down and more than the QB would like. Hot one, hot two, three. They're taking what the defense has given them. That's a four-yard gain on the reception. Hey, less than a wipe with a headache. Third down and eight. Hot three. Does the QB know which... Oh, and he just left an outline on the ground like he was trying to wipe out the dinosaur. Must be opposite day because he's the one who just got wiped out. It's first and ten. Oh, what a punishing hit that was. And that's how you make a guy remember your name and your shoe size. Because he just walked all over him. Second down and five. Oh, man, Brooks, you got to love a player who goes down fighting. The offense lost another running back and only two remain on their roster. When a team loses all their running backs, they lose their ability to run the ball. Yeah, like if I rip out your tongue, you won't be able to speak. Tell us something we don't know, genius. And that'll bring up third and one. Receiver and deflected the ball. And up comes the most underrated position in football, the mighty punter. He boomed that one. Let's see if they can get a return. And he snags the punt and looks for open field. And he sends him to the ground with an exclamation point. And a well-placed cleat. Time to speed things up. The offense goes into a two-minute drill. Hot two. Three. Oh, a 
a great catch, and he picks up a new set of downs. And it's first and ten. I won. I... One time when I was playing, a guy hit me so hard, I went into a dark tunnel. Thought I saw my grandparents waving at me in the light. Turns out it was just the vi And that's the end of the second quarter. Someone will need to pull together some bribe money as they head to their lockers. Stay with us for the Halftime Show, brought to you by our friends at Monsatan Industries. We make genetically altered Frankenfood you'll have fun trying to identify. We are back for the second half as the teams line up for the kickoff. The coach told his players they'll be strung up on the goalposts if they don't make this a game in the second half. That's how you motivate these pricks. The best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. And it's first and ten. The offense is pretty much unstoppable when they use their beast boost injection. Close your eyes, Bricks. This is going to get ugly fast. a really violent game, guys. Bingo! Bingo! I just hit that mutant bingo! And all I was missing was his number for the last three plays! Talk about luck! The offense is down to their last running back. No rest for the weary. The last runner has to suck it up and hopefully not die. And it's first and ten. Oh, and the defense jumps on side to the tank. And the whistle blows the play dead. You got to jump over those mines or steer clear of them. The offense lost another quarterback on the previous play and have only two left before they have to forfeit. Yeah, but on the bright side, Wim, they save a ton of money by not having to pay those guys anymore. Uh, the, the funeral expenses, that is. First down and five. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. He's leaving a wake of destruction in his path. The offense has no running backs left, so this becomes a passing only offense. Uh, they can still run it with their QB, right, Grim? Sure, they can run their QB into the defense that's feasting on runners. <laughs> Sounds like a good plan, moron. Hey, watch it. Second down and nine. Not one. Eight. And the ball razors through the defense, cutting it. And he zips that one in there for a touchdown. And if you don't understand why refs are hated even more than kickers, <laughs> well, there's your answer, Bricks. I know. I hate those zebra men. Second down and a lot. And the offense jumps on sides to kill the ref. They say, we're mad as hell and not going to take it anymore. You know, Briggs, when the ref is faster than your football team, you got some serious issues. <laughs> Second down and a offense says it's time to put the ref out of his misery. Second down and ain't gonna happen, partner. Hot one, hot two, hot three. And another interception. This quarterback is gonna listen to Joy Division and we Oh, and he breaks free and has nothing but open field in front of him. The boom to the moon. Another loser bites the dust. And the MFL winning is really about 
how much you want it, Bricks. Well, he clearly didn't want to live as much as the other guy. That's a good point, Grim. Say what? Come on, man, you can't hang with me. You get my grill, I'm gonna ruin your world. You understand me? And here comes the extra point attempt. The kick is good. And as expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. The teams are lined up for the kickoff. They're going to be able to return this one. First and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two. Hey. And the back gets in there and slots the ball away. He can oh, holy smokes. He just killed that player with a cheap shot. That's why we love the MFL. Second down and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot three. Defense gets another pick. Man, oh, with the punishing hit. Yo, man, nobody can touch you an eyeball. I take all you mutants out. That's right. What you talking about? And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot eight. Man, this guy just blew up and he's on fire. I'm not talking about that. Fire modes. I mean, literally, he's like burning bacon. To and he's off to the races. Holy mother of mutant mayhem! He scored. Hey, you see that move, baby? No, you didn't. You know why? I'm the greatest, greatest. I tell you. <laughs> Don't make any mistakes here, or they'll kick the shit out of you in the locker room. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuff burrito from Taco Hell. The home team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five. You can't keep a good mutant down. Oh, the unstoppable force meets the explodable object. Yo, seriously, man, you think you can go toe-to-toe -to -toe with me? I will wreck your world. You understand me, Junior? I'll wreck your world. The burn returner was killed on that play. The coach will replace him with another player. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot. And nobody can touch you when I ball. I take all you mutants out. That's right. Hey, what you talking about, pal? Second down and long. <laughs> Boom, dead and down. He delivered the freaky fast ham sandwich with extra mustard for the death blow. Speaking of ham sandwiches, I'm gonna go grab one. You want anything? Now, yeah, still working on my salami here, Bricks. Thanks. That's what she said. Ah, ah, didn't work that time. It was close, though. Yep. And that'll bring up third down and seven. Hot one, hot two, hot. Three. And that's a run for no gain. Boring, but smart. Time to punt. Whoa, whoa, you can't say that on the radio. Nice punt. Should move them back nicely. Nice catch, and he turns on the afterburners. Punt returners in this league have a life expectancy. He just made mincemeat out of that guy. Boom, and like the Titanic, his ship just went down. Hey, hey I almost got that mutant bingo. All I need is 77 to bite it. He's at the 30. He's at the 20. The 10. 
This defender is not going to be stopped. Once he picked up that loose ball, he was going to score or die trying. Luckily for him, he scores! See that move, baby? I'm the greatest. No, you didn't see it. <laughs> And they line up for the extra point. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. Says, who's next? Boom, dead and down. He just sent a message with that hit. Yeah, the message was you can't kill the messenger because he's going to kill you. But then he won't be able to read the message because the messenger killed him. Ah, going in circles. Oh, seriously, man, you think you'd go toe to toe with me? You get my grill, I'll ruin your world. Ruin it. The burn returner was maimed by the opposing team, so it's up to the next man to replace him. Yeah, what exactly is a burn returner, Grim? Now, players who catch kickoffs and punts and run them back through the teeth of the defense. They have the lowest survivability rate of any player in the league. The next man up just sat back down on the bench. He probably cramped his pants. Don't want to make any mistakes here. Just kick the ball through the upright, for God's sake. It's good. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if the defense can hold them. He sets up for the return. Let's see if he can break one wide open. Don't you just love the sound of bones snapping and cracking? I mean, when they're not yawn. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot. hot. And he just popped his eyes in the back of his head. That quarterback can be hurting or dead. Yo, man, nobody can touch you an eyeball. I take all you mutants out. That's right. What you talking about? Second down, and we've got to pick up at least half of this. Hot two. The quarterback is getting mauled out there. Third down, and never going to happen. And there's another pick. Boom! Hey, you see that move, baby? No, you didn't. You know why? I'm too fast for you. I'm the greatest. The greatest, I tell you. <laughs> First down and seven. Hot. Hot one. Hot. And he breaks through for a touchdown. Listen to this. You think you can go toe-to-toe -to -toe with me? Well, you mistaken, man. You get up in my grill, I'm gonna ruin your world. I'm gonna wreck it. Don't try to get fancy here. Just put the ball down and kick it. In that order, Grim? It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuff burrito from Taco Hell. Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. That, my friends, was an all-pro MFL hit. And it's first and ten. 
Hot one, hot two, hot, hot three. Hey man, nobody can touch me when I ball. I take all you mutants out. That's right. Hey, what you talking about, Pop? Second down in a very lot. Oh, and he might have just saved a touchdown on that deflection. Third down, and the punter is warming up. Hot two. The quarterback unleashes us. And with another pick, the QB says, I don't know how to throw interceptions, but when I... Is he dead? Uh, nah, he's still moving. Crap, I have money on him biting the big one. If he don't die soon, my loan shark is gonna kill me. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot eight. And he picks up eight yards on a strong run. Second down and two. Hot, hot one, hot two, eight. He's rumbling and stumbling. He could go all the way. And the quarterback drills one in for the first. Oh, holy Montezuma's revenge. That's a crap your pants and die tackle. Oh, that Montezuma was very vengeful, wasn't he, Bricks? Wonder what made him so mad. That was probably all the diarrhea. Yeah, you're probably right. Yeah, they probably ran out of toilet paper when he was in some all-inclusive resort. And he just got so mad and cursed everyone who came to Mexico forever to crap their pants. Huh. Sounds like he didn't really think it through, because, you know, he should have made it specifically for the owners of the inclusives, but they're not the guests. What the fuck are you talking about? Uh, I don't really know right now. What day is it? Hot one, hot two, three. And the MFL keeps pounding out the death hits on WMFL 98.8, the greatest hits of all time. Uh, did you just say greatest hits? Where? The offense is running low on running backs. They have only two left. They need to conserve those runners now and consider passing more. And the offense goes into the hurry-up formation to try to conserve time. And that's the way you play a guy. Nice coverage. The offense wants to speed things up, so it signals a hurry up. Yeah, same as Brits' ex-girlfriend signaled when they were doing it. Yeah. I don't know whose eyes the QB is using, but can we get him some new... Ooh, that hit's gonna shave a few days off his life. And it's first and ten. Second down and more than the QB would like. Hot one, hot two, hot, hot, hot eight. And there's a huge gain, and this offense is rolling. Logan, that was a pass play. Rolling plays are in bowling. And that'll bring up third and one. Hot, hot one, hot two, eight. And he runs into the end zone. Touchdown. Baby, I'm the greatest. No, you didn't see that. Too fast. <laughs> you know, this should be easy, but with kickers, you never know. Straight through the uprights. The teams are lined up for the kickoff. Not a bad kick, but not a great one either. Well, his nickname is Lukewarm. And he's proud of that? Yeah, that's why he named his clothing company Lukewarm Threads. Their marketing team hates it. And the quarterback goes into a hurry-up offense and calls all the plays from the line of scrimmage from here on out. 
Oh, oh great tackle. When his brain is unscrambled, he'll be th There's a funny red head on the field. Now that's their red penalty marker, Briggs. Looks like this one's coming back. The offense is losing quarterbacks faster than teams lose their minds at spring break. They're down to their last QB before they have to forfeit. In a hurry-up offense, there is no huddle, so neither team can put their players on the bench. Hey, man, you see that? That's right, you can't handle this. You can't handle what I got. Yeah, get the hell out of here, man. Third down and, well, good luck. Nobody can touch you an eyeball. I take all you mutants out. That's right. What you talking about? Man, this coach, the offense takes the first time out. Do you think the universe is alive, Grim? Yeah, looks like whatever you had before the game is starting to kick in, Bricks. You might want to have a little orange juice and lie down. And he put all of his foot into that one. And it sails out of the end zone for a touchback. The offense will get it on the 20. And it's first and 10. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot. This is your brain, and this is your brain on first. Oh, great pass block. That's just as good as a sack. No, it ain't. When you get a sack, you get to hit the QB in the nuts. Well, yeah, good point, Junior. Second down and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. Hot. And the quarterback throws a murder ball, which will slice its way through. And he held on to that one for a first down. And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. Hot. running back. When he bites the dust, they can only pass. Yeah, well, at least they don't have to forfeit, man. That's right, but now the defense can focus on killing the receivers. Second down, the second. Look out, that's an all-out attack on the QB. It's not how many times you fall, it's how you get back up. Yeah, in this particular case, I'm thinking defibrillators and 100 cc's of adrenaline. Yeah, an eight ball wouldn't hurt either. Did somebody say cocaine? The offense has only two quarterbacks remaining on the roster. They better be careful because when those guys die, it's forfeit city. And it's first and ten. <laughs> Bam! Say goodnight to that guy, Bricks. Uh, good night to that guy, Bricks. You're an idiot. Oh, man, he really... And a hard run there picks up the... Oh, come on, that was a cheap shot. <laughs> That's why I love this guy. And so do the fans. The offense has no running backs left, so they will lose all running plays in their playbook. And it's first and ten. That's a gain of seven yards on the catch. Nicely done. Second and three. And he put on the afterburners after that catch and scored. Nicely done. And here comes the extra point attempt. The kick is good. And as expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. The 
best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. Oh, devastating hit. You ever get hit that hard, Bricks? Yep. Third grade. Sister Mary Margaret and our ladies of holy hell. I thought it was brass knuckles, but it was just a regular knuckles. Oh, the defender almost picked off the ball on that one. And the hurry-up offense wears out the defense since they can't rest their players. Hey, you see that move, baby? No, you didn't. You know why? I'm too fast for you. I'm the greatest. The greatest, I tell you. <laughs> Third down and forever. That ball was almost intercepted. And the punter takes a break from knitting on the sidelines to come in and punt. His knitting is superb, Grim. That cross stitching, unbelievable. And he's got a chance for a good return. Pow! With the brain scrambler. And it's first and ten. And he's off to the races. Look at that little mutant run. Uh, I don't think you can say that, Graham. Oh, boy. And it's first and ten. from prison just came out of the field. It's the ref, idiot. Oh. Let's see what the penalty is. First and two. secondary for you pay it for the pick six for this you just give them a pat on the head and tell them they don't suck second down and two <laughs> and he catches it for a touchdown what a beautiful play yeah it's almost poetic grim like a haiku <laughs> <laughs> okay, nice and easy like a two-foot putt. You miss two-foot putts all the time, Grim. It's good. Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. The quarterback shifts gears and goes into his hurry-up offense. Oh, that's a vicious hit. Oh, mama. Just call him Cap and Crunch. Another one bites the dust. When in a hurry-up offense, the offense needs to run out of bounds or take a timeout to stop the clock. And he snatches that one out of the air for a first down. See if they can get something going here. The quarterback is controlling the clock right now like the clock is into it. He just clock-blocked the clock. The offense goes into their two-minute drill. What the hell is that? It's the same thing as a hurry-up offense, you mark. And the defense gets another pick. Man, rough day. He could go all the way. Great 
shoestring tackle. And it's first and ten. And that's a great nine-yard completion there. Hey, it ain't great if you don't score or move the chains. And that's their last timeout. The defense can't bend or break. They've got to get a stop here. And that'll bring up second and one. First down and one. He had nowhere to go and got nothing out of it. And that'll bring up second and one. He was stuffed at the line of scrimmage. And he lines up for the field goal attempt, trying to ignore the defensive threats of murder. And I don't want to see the comment section on that replay of the kick. Yeesh. The jugular cracked some skulls today and take the victory. Folks, this wasn't even close. It was a total shellacking, like watching a knife cut through butter. More like an axe through butter, Grim. More like a chainsaw through baby shit, because that pretty much describes what we just saw. And the MVP of today's game is just about to speak. As soon as he gets his jaw back in place. Oh, there he's got it now. Yep. <laughs> with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. and all the folks at Evil SN want to thank you for watching this presentation of the Mutant Football League. Today's game was brought to you by the Hexon Oil Corporation. We drill it, spill it, and kill it so you...